Hi guys, welcome back to another video and in today's video we're going to be showing you guys how to save your SHSH blobs from a device. Um, this only works on the iPhone 4, the iPhone 3GS and the iPod Touch 4th generation, all because they have boot ROM exploits. If you have a newer device, this won't work, but I'll also show you guys how to save iOS 6.1.3 SHSH blobs to Cydia because Apple recently started signing them again. Now the first thing you want to do to save your SSH blobs from a device is put the device in DFU mode. To do that, you need to hold the power and home button for 10 seconds and when the display goes black, release the power button after 2 seconds but keep holding the home button. Make sure you also have the, your device plugged into a computer, otherwise it won't actually stay in DFU mode and you'll see an Apple logo. If you see an Apple logo or connect to iTunes logo, you need to try again. After your device is in DFU mode, you can download and open Red Snow. Then all you need to do is click on Extras, SSH Blobs, and then Fetch. This will exploit the device and get the blobs out of the device. Now there is a chance that you could screw up your device by doing this, so make sure you have everything backed up and there may be a chance that something could go wrong. I didn't have any luck with the Mac version of Red Snow, it just kept failing on the exploit, so I had to use Windows and a lot of these tools are Windows only. Links for everything will be down in the description of course, but once you've saved the SHSH blobs, you can go ahead and query them and you can see them um, saved on Cydia's servers. Now I also have iOS 6.1.6 .6 saved for my iPod Touch and I'm going to show you guys how you can do that. Um, now Red Snow only saves up to iOS 6.1.6 .6, so anything newer than that won't actually show up um, on the server. So to uh, save those blobs you need to download something called Behind, uh, go on to Select Mode and then SHSH and then you'll get this screen here, make sure your device is connected obviously and then just, all you got to do is click on Save SHSH and that will save it to a folder on your desktop called Behind SHSH. When you open that folder, you'll see the SHSH you've saved, and you can see there iPod Touch iOS 6.1.6. .6. Then you need to go back into Red Snow, Extras, SSH Blobs, and then Submit. Find the SHSH file you just saved using Behind, and go ahead and upload that to Cydia. Now this also works for the iPhone 4S um, if you want to save iOS 6.1.3 SHSH. Apple started signing that recently, so you can go ahead and upload that just in case they ever stop signing it. And to do that, it's the same process, open behind, select SHSH, and save it, and then just upload it to Red Snow like we just did. Another tool you can use to save SSH and also upload SHSH, it's called 3U Tools, it's Windows only, but you can go ahead and download and upload SSH files. This also works for iFaith files. Um, the problem with iFaith is that it saves them in a .ifaith file and that means that you can't actually upload them to Cydia. But you can upload them to 3U tools. iFaith can also dump your SHSH blobs from the device just like Red Snow. So if Red Snow doesn't work, you can always try iFaith. If you have anything newer than iOS 6 blobs, you can also upload those to 3U tools and you can download them whenever you want as well as keeping them on your hard drive. Now this didn't seem to work on my iPhone 3GS on iOS 3.1.2, it just failed on the iFaith finding the blobs on the device. I'm not sure exactly why that is but either way, this should help you save your SHSH blobs and get them somewhere on Cydia or wherever that you can find them and come back to them if you ever accidentally update. So with that being said, these are a few methods on actually saving your SHSH blobs. Now this doesn't always work as you can see with my 3GS, but I hope you guys found this video interesting. And if you're not already subscribed, go and hit that subscribe button and I'll catch you guys next time. Another one for my great videos.